Hello and welcome back to some more Diablo 4. We're going to try a tier 40 pit. As you can see, I've leveled up a load. I have masterworked things a bit more than I had last time. Um, so let's go see if this build, um, that hasn't really changed much, um, can do a pit 40 now. I can definitely feel we are still slower than we were going through the 35. Need more time. But it's also not terrible. We are going to be focusing on just charging through, making sure we kill all the elites we can. As fast as we can, basically. Shaman, you can go away. There we go, that wasn't bad. Let's get through to the next area. Might as well take on large groups since they still give us some uh, bar filling. I don't know what to call it, really. Definitely feel like I need like a God Slayer's crown or something like that. Though we are doing this without a potion or anything. So yeah, there is scope for me to add a potion and probably go a bit harder. Drowned Sea Hag, what? Why did Drowned Sea Hag just um, pop up? Is that who I'm going to be fighting? Damn it. I saw it on the floor. I thought it was just the remnants of my um my Jaguar there. But I guess not. There we go. Is it going to be drowned sea hag? Yes. That's weird that I saw that early. I don't like this like fog that is surrounding her. Although we did stun her very quick. <laughs> 
And she down. That was extremely fast. Very nice. We have another... Ooh. Sorry, just had to click my knuckles because I could feel it. Um, yeah, we have another... Glyph to level up. And right, we have two. We'll take that. Um, where do we go next here? Damage reduction one moving on wasn't that interested in. Lucky hit, dodge chance. After moving 10 meters. I do move a lot and very fast, so... That is something that I do want to aim for. And then we may go for the... Actually, yeah, we probably will go for the maximum life. Uh, just because we do have a lot of life. Um, and not a lot of anything else. Right. Come on, let's scrap that lot. Repair the gear. We'll go in for a 45 now. We may as well. I will chuck on a potion, actually. We have got another legendary, which is quite nice trying to keep these reasonably well organized don't know where i got that from invoke a skill from another class okay that's a bit of a so you could invoke something you could make a really weird loop go around um Of, yeah, weird. Right, let's throw on. What do we just put on that? The grants players. Oh, no, maybe not. Critical strike chance or life? Critical strike chance. I think my critical strike chance is pretty high anyway, but... Not I had your back. Thanks for having my back. Oh my god, my resistances are a little bit low. Critical strike chance, nearly 50%. That's not bad. Okay. Definitely feeling slower. Still feel reasonably strong though. So it can't all be bad. We're not like carving through everything like we were before, but we are still carving. We aren't really taking a whole heap of damage either, so that's really nice.
What was that other resistance? Damn it. Just as I said, it wasn't taking much damage. But two damage resistant auras. I wasted my Jaguar. Um, not noticing. But they are both dead now, so... We can come in like that and clear that. I wish your critical chance affected your lucky hit a little bit as well. That'd be nice. Oh, we're back in, like, the castle dungeon. Someone selling some penitent grieve for stars for greater aspect. Jesus. Yeah, I really need to just purely focus on. Purely focus on the elites. was a large enough group there to incentivize me into keeping going shit nearly died did die I think I might struggle th uh, this one I think I'm going to get to the boss. It's whether I can stun the boss quick enough. Because if I can't take the boss out in like a few minutes, well, less than a minute, I'm going to really struggle. Don't know why I just carried on attacking him for ages. Chief Marauder. That's going to be what we fight. This this exact location was where I saw Drowned Sea Hag. Get this guy down before he can summon up two more. 
Nope, he still summoned them. There we go. Come on, get him down. Damn it. Oh, he's tough. That guy's really tough. Frozen. Need to get out of that. There we go. I might not make it. I've died too many times. Well, we're there. We're there. We have a Jaguar. And my ferocity is about to go. Right, stunned. Oh, it's slow. It's very slow. Don't want to get hit by that. Come on, not far. Come on, 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 come on. Yes. Nice ancestral ring. We were heading up there. Oh, definitely won't be able to do 55 right now, but that was good. That went really well. Right, what did we get from that? An insist vulnerable damage, nice. Life and vulnerable damage. I'd need critical strike chance on it. But that is a massive amount of vulnerable damage. So we will be keeping that and working on it. Fucking yeah, penitent grieves four stars. Ridiculous. Although it's not that much, like 90% cold resistance. Yes. Chill slow potency. If you were a frost, like an ice build, that would be absolutely ridiculous. Um, right, we can get rid of all of that. I'm not going to do that ring right now. We are going to... Do we do this or do we do that? Oh, I'm going gonna, gonna to do an eight. Eight wave. Eight wave horde to finish up
Well, that was that was a good first wave, I feel. It's a bit panicky, but Damn it, they both much prefer the Hellborn. Of the Hellborn. Need more time. You lot can go away. Stuck in that poison. And with throwing so many ballistas around, getting frozen in poison is not a good way to go. Oh, ether fiends. It's going to be that. Utter chaos. Need more time. Need more time. You can go away. Damn ballistas. Nice. Ooh. We will take more Hellborn. Four Hellborn a time. <laughs> oh, look at it all.
That was fun. Uh, uh. It's probably not the best of choices, but... There we go, we're still getting some Hellborn, so... Hellborn are profitable, so... It's all good. Exalted Hordes. Yeah, it's only for two more waves, but we can afford to die a few more times. Kill you nice and quickly. No, we can't. Really thought I had him. Oh shit, there's like three lords there, I think. Plus all the other elites. Let me out the way. Not ready. Oh. Oh. That was a bit mad. Hellborn damage. Yeah, that will hopefully give me just a load more Hellborn this final round. There is just so much going on. Okay. It's all done. Just the... <laughs> just the council. Jesus. Healing received. Probably... Well, I might end up changing that, but we might as well use the well while we're here. And then we just focus down one at a time.
Where's the other one? There he is. That's just the spectre. No. Pretty good. Did you just get three helms there? Was that what I saw? Three helms. Ah, oh, damn it! You have to choose. So I can do that, and then I have to choose between gold or materials. Jesus Christ! That's finally done. That's ridiculous. I, the chests this season. The chests this season take two Crown of Lucians. One of those better be better than what I've got. Ooh, a fast staff with oh, decks. Damn you. For getting my hopes up. How much gold do I have? 14. Not a lot, but... I can always do another one of these. That is a ton of obductite or whatever it's called. 800. <laughs> oh, man. Right. Back to town. There you go. I think... I think that's proving that this build albeit probably I'm sacrificing some armor and probably some damage resistance for the apprehension um, aspect and binding morass aspect but it does keep me safe um, pretty well like it does a really good job. But right. That is it for today. And if you want to see more, like and subscribe. Um, there's been a video pretty much every day for the last... Almost since Diablo came out. I think I've missed like a couple of days. Um, since Diablo 4 released near two years ago i don't know a year ago i've lost totally lost track 18 months ago three five years ago i don't know but anyway thanks for watching see you next time bye